and that's a very and as opposed to where you go just like that. Right. And that but see, that's part of his personality. But it also again. directs back to exactly what you said about caring about your magic. If you just go boom, that's your card, it means you don't care. If you go, well, I really well, you're, care you're, about you're, 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 you're actually bringing in the audience and making them focus on it. Wait a second, and causing it, and, and hopefully causing a doubt whether or not he got it, and, and that kind of draws them in. Yeah. And that way, when you turn it over in a dramatic fashion, it, it, it creates more. It's, it's like a stagger cut on a movie, you know, like. Choo, 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 choo. Right. Wow. Yeah, just just think of that with a with a camera shooting and coming in close as you're doing this kind of thing. If you think of a camera on you, you're going to be a lot clearer with what you're trying to communicate, and you'll be a lot cleaner in your movements. You know, if you're just aware that the camera's going to going to do close up on us, right? You know, and so a lot of people, when I worked with Bill Malone, uh, he would do things like this: you turn over the cards. You know, and it was fine. I mean, it was funny. There was nothing wrong with it. But I said, but there's two people here, and they're your audience, but there's an audience out there. And they can't see this. Now, the camera's up higher and can look down. But I said, turn them this way. Now, right. everybody will be able to see, and they'll get the message. Well, it, that little tiny thing made such a huge difference. That was gigantic. It's not a little tiny. I mean, that's a gigantic one. Just thinking about everything you do. So, so I guess the bottom line of this whole discussion is... It's all about thinking and paying attention to details and caring, right? And that's, uh, you want to be a great magician, you don't need the latest $50 DVD or trick. You just need to care about what you do and understand it and care about your audience and care about the details. The details. So, those, so basically it's easy to be a great magician, really. Dostoevsky said, attention to detail separates the men from the boys. And you just said it. But I'm not Dostoevsky. <laughs> or are you? We have to pay you again. Huh? Are you you may be. It may be a rebirth. Okay, guys, our uh, magic buddies uh, at home, I hope you've uh, enjoyed uh, the chat. This has been a while. This has been a while. Yes, yes, it has been. Mr. Eric Camp, Mr. Bob Finch. We weren't quite sure what we were going to talk about, about but and, uh, and myself, yeah. we hope it's been beneficial for you and that you get some ideas out of it. I mean, what you've got here is a bunch of years of experience, and uh, the experience. Showing how by doing little things and thinking about your magic, uh, it can not only be a better trick, but people will like you more. And it'll become more tricks, it'll become magic. Become magic. Oh, I like that. Uh, Let's do magic. Absolutely. Cheers. See Bye. you guys.